Good evening, everyone. I am here to with Broken's Cooking Show to show you how to make butter. I've been doing this since 810 and it is now 9.53. And come here, everybody, don't be shy. Come over here and look. See this cream here is all the stuff I've taken off the top of the milk after I've milked it. And that little spots there is the beginning of butter. And here in a little bit, hopefully we'll have some butter. And I gotta get the salt. You gotta make sure to put lots of salt in it so it'll stick keep. Well, it is now 10 o'clock, so it has been two hours, and I do believe we have some butter. See, you look in here, and you can kind of see some yellow stuff, especially on the sides right there. So, let's open it up and see. I think we have whipped butter. It's whipped cream. This is whipped cream right here. All you'd have to do is put some uh, sugar and stuff in it and it would be whipped cream. But if we want butter so we're going to keep shaking it for a little bit. Tastes like butter. I think we shook it too long to be whipped cream. <laughs> oh, hello there. I was just wondering how much longer I would have to be standing here waiting. It's almost been two hours and 20 minutes that I've been doing this. So, better or not, we're gonna make it. <laughs> we have whipped butter, that's pretty. So we're going to drain the buttermilk off. Oh, we got to put it in the cup, that would be helpful. Some people like to drink the buttermilk. It's pretty strong, but we save it for the dog. Okay, now that we got all that in there, we got to put it in here, and you got to work the milk out of it, because there will be some, quite a bit of milk sometimes left in the butter that you have to work out. As you can see, there was quite a bit. We gotta dump it out. And then we add a little bit, a little bit of salt, but I can't see nothing. This whipped butter is usually really soft, like this, and it's kind of like, well it's just like whipped cream feeling like, and it doesn't usually like to stick on you like normal butter would, but to tell how much salt we have and how much we need, we got to Take a little nibble out of it.
You want it to taste almost more salty than store-bought butter, or it won't last as long. Because it's raw milk. And because it's raw milk, it won't last near as long. It's more pure and healthy. And this concludes of Roken's cooking show for the first time.